Good morning everybody welcome back to my channel if you are new here and you have not already make sure you hit that red subscribe button down below it's completely free become part of the family today we have a fun day so i wanted to start you off with a little outfit of the day don't mind the mess behind me we're waiting for cardboard day super simple casual i feel like this looks a little weird up here because it's a little see-through and you can see my tank top underneath but i just wanted to be super comfy and wear like a little tank underneath instead of like a regular bra it's just so hot out i have I haven't done my hair in so long. It's just been up and it's just too hot to even think about wearing a bra. I just don't want to. So it might look a little weird, but comfy it is. This shirt here is from Boohoo. And then the tank that I have underneath it is from Amazon. These are like super cute, simple tanks. And they work really good for under t-shirts, under things like this. I wear them like under everything or just by themselves as well. Shorts are, you guys already know, Abercrombie and Fitch. These are my favorite, definitely worth the money. They're like, 60 bucks i believe but oh my god these have been like my staple i wear them with everything they are the perfect length if you have like sort of thicker thighs like i do and they rub together when you walk these are amazing they're like four inches so you don't get that chub rub in between the back is super cute as well nice and long so you don't got to worry about any cheeks hanging out i just like to feel very comfortable and secure and they're very stretchy denim i hate when things are stiff so really really love these definitely a favorite this year and then i'm just wearing these sandals i believe these are from just fab i think I don't really remember, but I think just fab. I'll link something similar. And then my earrings are from Amazon. These have been my favorite as well. These are like $13. They are so cute. I still need to get a new purse. I know I'm not wearing black today, so this doesn't really match that well, but I'm not a girl that changes her purses all the time. It's just not for me, but I definitely need a new one. She's, it's her time to go, but this is from Old Navy. And then I'm also wearing this name necklace. Let's see if we can get better lighting. I'm wearing this little nameplate necklace. It just says my name on it. And this website is super affordable. They're only like 25 bucks for customized necklaces so it's a great gift for yourself or a gift for somebody for like a birthday or something it's really nice quality i don't get it wet though i wouldn't recommend that will just make it tarnish quicker but yeah super affordable and it's like super nice and thick i love this style they have so many different styles on their website so if you guys are interested i'll have the link this isn't sponsored or anything but if you do use my link i make a small commission so that would be greatly appreciated you guys will love it it's like super nice for so affordable Love a good affordable option. Okay, I lied to you guys. Since we're going to be doing like shopping and walking around, I changed into my more comfortable shoes. I literally forgot about these until I saw them sitting in our little basket by the door. Way more comfy. But these are from Boohoo. They're like wannabe Birkenstocks. They're like $12, I believe. They have them in white and black. And they're so comfortable. They've been like my go-to. You can see they're super worn in already. Love these. Since I have this black purse and there's no lack in my outfit, I'm going to use my little sunnies. These are from Amazon as like an accessory. I'll probably end up wearing them too, but I feel like it kind of pulls it together, the black accessories, you know? All right, I think we are ready now. I'm excited for today. Had a productive morning, got in my workout, got ready for the day, had some avocado toast, so good. I'm trying to hold things and vlog, so I'm potato vlogging. Oh, it's a hot one, boys. So, my mom is gonna be here shortly to pick me up. We're gonna use her car today because if we get bigger items, we need a bigger car, but if you missed, my last vlog, I'm gonna fill you in on what we're doing today. We finally got the deck built, which I'm so excited about, but needs a little upgrading back here. And my mom loves interior designing and decorating, so I figured why not have her help? She actually offered, she's like, can we go shopping? She gets so excited. So I think we're gonna look for a new set for here today. I also ordered something really cool that my parents have in their backyard. If you've seen recently when I vlogged there, they have like a sale across their table. I ordered that on Amazon, so that should be coming in like a few days. So so we're definitely not gonna get every single thing done today, but we're gonna safely go shopping with our masks and socially distance in big stores. Um, we're gonna try and see if we can do maybe some curbside pickups, if there's anything that we see online. But I know my mom said that Michaels was having like 70% off of like the fake greenery, which is like what I want all back here. So yeah, we're just gonna go shopping, find some stuff. We had a storm last night, so I guess this fell down, but we need to get some new palm trees for here. Those I'm gonna get real, but as far as like the pots and stuff, we're gonna get some like fake greenery and then probably another pot to go right here. And then we'll see if we can find like a new, I wanna do like a little couch and then like two chairs and like a coffee table maybe, but I have like a vision on Pinterest. I'll pop up the picture here that me and my mom have been looking at. I like when everything is like mismatchy. I feel like it looks very magazine i don't want to get like one set that like matches if that makes any sense like i want to get like some mismatchy stuff and make it look cute the table and chairs have like 
done us good, but I feel like I want it to look more, I don't know, just like more modern, more adultish, more just upgraded, really. So yeah, we have a slight vision. We're gonna go shopping with our masks and we're gonna hope that we can find a little bit of stuff, but I'm, ha I'm having a feeling I'm gonna have to order a lot of stuff online, but we're gonna do our best. Really cute angles today. It's so sunny, I can barely even see. Good morning. Good morning. Well, I look summered up. Summer, you look all summer. Oh, thanks. <laughs> it's gonna be 90 degrees today. Oh, like guacamole. Wow, Ma. It's hot. We just filmed a whole clip and I wasn't even recording. No. I'm so sad. What did we even say? You wanna redo it? No. Take two. <laughs> First stop is Michael's. That's what I was saying. We're gonna get some greenery. Hopefully it's not crowded. It's a pretty big store. We can socially distance. We should be okay. Mega clearance, 70% off. Get a cart, we're gonna need it. <laughs> <laughs> you got hand sanitizer in the car? In the car, yeah. Okay. Oh my God, I haven't been out shopping in like never. Oh my God. It doesn't look that crowded. It's a little too yeah, fake. Too fake yeah. But the idea is good. Oh my god, I miss the smell of Michael's. <laughs> I smelled it so long. Is your first time? Oh, there's like no one in here. Okay, this is good. This is, this is good. Oh, hand Sandy. You wanna put it on now? Don't tell me they have pumpkin stuff out already. Uh-huh. Is that real? Yep. Like they're starting to sell fall? I mean, what? They do, it, they do it every year. As a matter of fact, my memories came up it's and it was July, on the It just like, turned July. What? That's insane. I feel a lot better that there's like not a lot of people here. Yeah, no. Wait, there's cute lanterns that we wanted right here. Oh, wow. We just stay away from people and we'll be good. The candles are back to by nine. Oh, they were on sale? I need Look, some what candles. About, what about something like this by the staircase? If you could line them up. Yeah, how many? There's a small though. How many are we going to need? Still 70% so <laughs> yeah, these look like too fake though, you know what I mean? Look how pretty this is. You can put it in This is nice. That's nice. You can get a couple of these and work with them. I don't know, you know better. You have Oh I can make it nice too. Yeah. yeah. These are outdoor though. Will they will they fade like? You take them in in the winter. Okay. But in the sun. No. Okay. They already faded. That's the good thing. Right. Yeah. I mean, you like this? Look, this is a hanging one. Let's... I don't like that. No? No. I like, like, more this. muted. This Someone's isn't bad. Broken, isn't it? Yeah, it is, but... Someone broke it out. Look. Oh. Meanies. The score. Look at this pot. 70% off. Look at how cute that is. It's broken. Is it? No. Or no, it's supposed to be like That's that. That's the way it is. I like this pot. Even if we don't end up using it outside, I'll use this you for inside. This yeah. Because I don't really have any vases You don't inside. like this, right? But I think this is so cute. Mm, no. Oh, God. It's got color. <laughs> Make sure no one's coming. Six feet apart? Okay, we're good. I like these circle ones. Oh, they have fake things in them. I have one kind of similar to that. But they have hooks, Dad. You could hang them. From where? Off the fence. Are these, gonna, are these for outside, though? I don't know if these are outside. Yeah, I have one on You're my just table. saying, yeah, like, you don't even know. Read it. Warning, inside. Okay. Yeah. Warning, Warning. inside. <laughs> okay, forget it. Okay, scratch that again. This is the color that I had, but I like this one better, the white with the beige. That's gonna look really nice, because I wanna do a lot of black accents, and I feel like the beige looks nice with that. All right, you guys saw the inspo picture. I wanna go with like, mix matchy, a little bit of black furniture, a little bit of beige, a little bit of white. You know, you know my like my neutrals. And we just found this section with all this greenery, because I feel like maybe this one that we have in here isn't really the vibe that I'm going for. This is pretty, but I wanna go for more like, I feel like I'm in a tropical place like this. This is perfect. All right, move up a little so I can grab Very it. like, what do you call this? Feathery. It's like palm tree. Yeah, like tropical. And then in the picture, they have it in like one of the glass vases, yeah. Do you want this big vase or you want a smaller one? Well, well we, I think we need more than one of those, oh, yeah. right? Yeah, see if they have another glass, maybe. I'm so bad at the vision. I know what I want, I just don't know how to get it. <laughs> Okay, I'm giving you a chance. <laughs> My mom said, give me a chance and I'll show you. Oh, look at these. Watch out. Look at the like, fanning sitting in the chair. These are cool. Mm -hmm. Those we could put in the pots that you had the palm trees in. That would look cool. Yeah, maybe. Success. I just saved $127. Imagine. Isn't that crazy? Things were on sale and I used a coupon. We'll put it in the car and then we'll go to Home Goods. All right, yeah, we got some greenery, we got some pots. We need the big stuff now. All right, so check. We got a bunch of like leaves, tropicalness. Dane's gonna love it. He loves like those tropical resort kind of vibes. And that's kind of what we're gonna go for. A mixture of that with some modern. It's gonna be cute. 
put all your pots, see these same hats? Oh yeah, they like hold them? Yeah. We were gonna go with these pots outside, but we figured we wanted to go with clear, but these can be really pretty for inside. They were on sale for like $4, you guys. So I was like, why not? These look like really nice high-end vases, you know? This is what we're gonna put it's outside. Pretty. It's gonna be so pretty. Also, you guys know I like my muted colors, but I think once these are in the sun, they'll fade a little bit, so it'll be nice. It's really nice, but we can't show it. We can't show it? I mean, you can, but. What is it? <laughs> put it on the back seat. I'm afraid it's gonna crash into that and break. It's that vase, the short vase. Oh, it'll fit right here, perfect. It's snug. Yeah, I also got this one, because this one was $7. <laughs> it'll be nice for like my kitchen table this upgrade. One we gotta spray paint. That one will spray paint, $4. That can fit in here too, Mom. Put it on, dude. Nice and snug, so that nothing moves around. Perfect. Gotcha. Perfect. It's not yours. <laughs> that is not mine. That's my vibe. <laughs> That's your vibe. <laughs> All right. Next stop is Home Goods. I said I wouldn't go here, so hopefully it's not too crowded. Mom, if it's too crowded, I'm not gonna want to walk around. Just letting you know. Oh, it's pretty nice and open. Yeah. Okay. Okay. One way. All right. We want a basket for outside. Well, the basket in the picture had like a cover on it, though. I mean, look at this, so even if it gets wet, it's okay, but I don't know if you like that. Why what? I feel like that could be cute. What am I putting in it, though? The other one, like, you don't really need to put anything in it. Yeah. You could actually put a big plant in it if you want. Mm -hmm. <laughs> right? You can do a lot of things. You just gotta have nice Let's go look at the rugs. I get so overwhelmed with stuff like this because I just don't know what to get, what to put where. They did widen the aisles. They did widen the aisles, yeah. A lot more room in here. This is nice, too, or this one. I think you should add tan. Yeah, I agree. I want to add some this tan. Cute. Tan and blacks and whites. I want to do. This was $17. <gasps> Love. Put it in the cart. Just put it in that cart. <laughs> okay, now we are in the rugs. Can you see five by eight? Yeah. Or so this is five, five by seven. Five by seven. I said either five by seven or five this by eight. This is definitely not outdoor. What does it say? This is definitely an indoor rug. Are you sure? Yeah, it looks like it. I don't think I see any that I love. Is this all that they have? I don't think love it. Yeah. Okay, score. I just found this. It says 19.99 at the bottom, but look, it's all like messed up here. But if we just like put it a certain way where you don't see that or like fill it with something, this could be cute. And we'll get it on sale. Look how cool that is. That's insane. To say goodbye, but I can help my feelings. Right now, I can't deny you never left my mind, and now my heart is bleeding. Why did I have to break? It's stuck on my earrings. So bad. I know that happens to me when I wear them. Yes, Eddie. Fire roasted garlic and onion potato chips. Woo! Mm. Really good. Tastes like those chips that you love, garlic and onion. <laughs> you know what, <like> try one. <laughs> Do I want to share? I thought you got them for Zane. Here, grab. I love kettle chips. Oh, the Lowe's is literally right there. Mm -hmm. Perfect. Forgot. Hungry. There's a lot of people out today. Yeah, I definitely was getting a little anxious in there. Mm. It was fine when we walked in, mm. and then I was like, okay, get me out of here. It's the weekend, it's almost, so. Wait a minute, it's only Thursday, right? It doesn't matter what day it is. Life isn't real right now. Mm. Holy guacamole, just got home, you guys. It is so hot outside, and I am starving. It is now almost four o'clock in the afternoon we're going to my parents for a barbecue at like 6 30 but i'm just gonna make myself a little something quick hi bailey everybody missed you today hello bailey girl say hello she doesn't want to be held right now you're a drama queen you're having fun exploring i'm gonna do a haul of everything that i got in just a little bit but first things first your girl gotta get something in her tummy so i'm actually gonna go on the barbecue because my dad taught me the other day how to use the barbecue so i'm like cool now <laughs> So I'm gonna make myself, usually I have a veggie burger, but I don't know, this morning all I had was avocado toast, so I'm feeling, treat myself to a beef burger. I'm still gonna put it on my, Jesus Christ, what's wrong with me today? I'm still gonna put it on my little garden. Oh my God. You good, fam? No. <laughs> I'm still gonna put it on my garden veggie wrap. These are literally only 60 calories. And then I'll put a little bit of shredded cheddar, a little bit of lettuce, we'll be good. Hi, baby. All right, here we go. Barbecue Alyssa coming in. Open. Okay, open this. Cool, I think that's open. Now we're gonna put this here. Hit this. Oh my God, I did it. And then you put this on and it should jump over. Oh wow, look at me freaking go. 
This is so much easier than making it inside. I was like, I kind of just want to have a burger, but then I'm like, I'm gonna put it on a skillet and it takes forever on the grill. It's so quick and easy. Barbecue for one. <laughs> Zane just made himself a sandwich quick, so. Yay, my burger's on. Cool. Oh, that's annoying. Okay, and then we have a little garbage right here. Ugh, dwarves. Okay, pick this up. Fell open. Oh, great, that means it all spilled out. All right, woo. Get some salt and pepper up in this beezy. Yes, please. Okay. It's been time between these clips. It just looks like there isn't. Okay. Now we're gonna take our cheese. Well, now that it's almost done. Okay, a little bit of shredded cheddar. You know what I'm saying? It's so hot, it's literally like immediately melting. That's good, that's good. Also gonna warm up my tortilla. Give that like a minute, probably less than a minute because it'll burn. All right, boys and girls, I left my tripod inside so there's no shot of me going in and getting it, but got the nice tortilla. Look at those little grill marks. Ooh, got my burger. I hope I cooked it right. I like it medium rare, so let's hope. This is the angle you guys are gonna get. Okay, we're gonna do a little bit of mayo on there. Oh, yes, please. Oh, here we go. I can use the mayo. Hello, nice to see you. Is this dark? Okay, oh, there we go. Now, some avocado. Literally never barbecued for myself. This is so funny. I feel like an adult. Okay, got the avo. I have, this is like some leftover lettuce. There's some romaine and then some arugula. Wrap it up like this, like this, and like this. And you've got a little burger wrap. This is actually so good. Wow, I kind of did that. Burger isn't exactly cooked to my liking. I actually overdid it a little bit, but that's better than underdoing it. Yum. All right, that was freaking delicious. Before I go inside and show you guys everything, I just wanted to show you really quick. Oh, I also grabbed um, Tiki Torch Fluid because this one's like about to be out. And since we're gonna be spending a lot more time out here, hopefully the warm weather lasts longer than September. But we definitely need um, Tiki Torches because it's so buggy out here. Anyways, for these two pots that last year we had palm trees in, there's also one right there. I got these little, what are these called? Pygmy date palm. Wow, they look like they get really big actually. These are so pretty, they're so light and airy, very tropical looking. I don't know if I said this on the vlog, but I know Zane likes the tropical vibe as if we're kind of like in a resort, like he really likes that look and so do I, so I kind of like went with both of our styles here. So I'm just leaving these outside. Um, I don't know if I should leave them right in the sun. I mean, it's gonna set soon, but not soon. It's definitely a few hours. I don't know where I should leave these. <laughs> It's pretty shady in the Lowe's outdoor area, so I'm gonna put these in the shade. I just put them on each side of the deck for now. Honestly, last year we had them in these things and I watered them like once in a while and they like survived on their own. I don't have a green thumb, so that's why a lot of the plants that I got are fake, but for the large plants, I just wanted to get real ones because I just feel like it makes it look so pretty back here. Oh my God, I'm out of breath. All right, I'm gonna bring in this stuff and then I'll show you what we got. Guess I was just a young girl living in a dream world I thought that I'd be better off But now I pay the price I do I don't know how to forget you I can't forget you You're always on my mind I do the things that I should do So I can't forget but you're always Let's see what we got. No, I just went to move this bench <laughs> and it opened. Oh God, it's all gonna fall out, isn't it? My pickup it fell down. Okay, there we go. Stuff that stuff back in here. I don't even know what's, oh. 
Okay, this lighting is not the best, but what are you gonna do? I have a few disclaimers. <laughs> we had a plan of what we, like the vision we were going for and what we kind of wanted to get. However, I kind of knew that we weren't gonna get everything and I'm gonna have to order some stuff online. So some of this stuff we might even return if we don't end up fitting it somewhere, but we kind of just grabbed a bunch of crap. Not crap, it's all very nice stuff. I bought a bunch of stuff and we're gonna see what we can make do with. I guarantee we'll find a spot for everything, even if it's in the house, because I do wanna do some upgrading in here as well. I did already order the rug for out there and and I'm going to, I'm still trying to hunt for the furniture that I want. I'm thinking I want to do some sort of two person couch and then two chairs on the other side or yeah, I think that's basically what I want to do. I want to do a two person couch, two chairs on the other side, a nice coffee table in the middle. The rug that I got is beautiful. I'm going to have you guys wait until I get that in the mail in a few days. So today I'm just going to show you the accumulation of stuff that we found at the store. And then once everything else comes in the mail, then we'll set everything up all properly outside. It's going to be a huge transformation. I am so so excited. Shopping was definitely strange today. I'm like anticipating that stores are gonna close down again. I hope not. I hope that there's no rise in cases and that we do continue to progress, but definitely felt very strange. Like, I feel like some people were being a little bit inconsiderate. Like they would walk right past you in the aisle where it's like, can you just, like I was waiting for people to be done in the aisle and then I would go in the aisle if I wanted to go in, you know, like keeping my distance, but definitely weird. Anyways, from Michael's, I found these really awesome little plants. They look actually pretty real and they actually feel kind of real, which is interesting. These were originally $9.99, but they were on sale for like $3, I believe. So I got a few of them. I just thought they were so cute. I think we're gonna probably put them in like this maybe but my mom's gonna spray paint this black i think i might have black spray paint actually but yeah we're gonna spray paint this black and then it'll be like super cute but michael's had everything on sale i was like oh my god i actually also grabbed these because they were on sale i was like why not these are some wax melts honey pear jasmine vanilla and wedding cake this one reminds me of my childhood like my mom used to always light the ones that smell like cupcakes and you would always think she was baking but like she never was <laughs> So I got those, they were like a dollar each. I also grabbed this, I'm hoping that this ends up looking nice because these two little branches were $15 each. Is that not insane? I had a coupon, so I think I got them for a little bit cheaper. I had like a 30% off, but I was like, oh my God, that's expensive. But they are really nice and thick bundles and all we really needed was two in here. Even one would look nice, like really minimalistic, but I feel like it would kind of, I don't know. Maybe we could go with one, we'll see. I think two just kind of fills it out a little bit more. And then we got this plain glass vase. I think it was about like maybe $10. It might've been on sale too, but this will go in the middle of the coffee table when we get one. I just know that if I make it super nice out there, like I'll wanna spend more time out there. I love being outdoors. And especially if we do get a second wave, like being outside in our own backyard is gonna be like our best option, you know? I also had to grab these two vases because A, I just feel like they look very luxe and they were on sale for 70% off. I got this one for literally $7. It is so nice. I think this will be great in our kitchen when I want to redecorate. And then I also did this one. So I'm thinking possibly in the kitchen, like these two next to each other will be nice. We'll see what I end up doing with these, but either way, I feel like I don't have any vases. Not, I feel like I don't have any vases. So I feel like they're a good decor piece. Those are good for if I get flowers for an occasion. I always put them in a mason jar because I don't have a vase. So that's good to have. This was on sale for like $4. I'm not sure what we're gonna do with it yet. I have some empty pots outside. So we might stick it in one of those, but just some more pretty greenery. And then also from Michael's, I believe we're gonna put these next to the stairs. We'll see, but these are so pretty as well. Again, I'm not a big fan of this bright, bright green. So I'm gonna hope that in the sun, they'll like fade a little bit, look a little muted, I think is the word that I'm looking for, like a more of a muted green. Either way though, I just love having greenery around me. It just feels, I think I said this 500 times, but so tropical. So love these. These were originally $29.99 and they were 70% off. $9 I paid for these. I'm pretty sure that was it at Michael's. If I forgot something, I'll show you. But next up is Home Goods. Wow, I've missed these videos, you guys. Hopefully they can stay. We will see. I could not leave Home Goods without getting a candle. I am like almost out of all my candles now. So I wanted to grab this one. This is Ocean and Sea Salt. It smells so fresh like laundry. I also always go for like the aesthetic of candles too because I like when it's out for it to look like very pretty. Love the packaging of this one. And it's a nice three wick candle. 
this is a maybe for us. We were indecisive on it, so we're gonna see if it fits in with everything. I wanted a lot of like textures and patterns and different like materials, so we're gonna see, but I do want to mix in the creams, whites, and blacks, so we just thought that the colorway of this was really nice. Also, it was only $12.99, so we're gonna see. Maybe we'll put like a fake cal calendar? <laughs> Maybe we'll put like a fake candle in here and it could look cute outside but possible return this was a find you guys this is like a what is it made in portugal it is the perfect colors you guys know i love my muted grays and tans and beige and it had this like little chip right here in it so we got it for 18 dollars. it was only originally 20 so they only gave us two dollars off for that but honestly i'm not mad at it this is so nice we could just put like maybe a little bit of paint there it'll look like antique-ish. This is literally a handmade ceramic pot made in Portugal. It's just so pretty. Look at that. $18. These are so expensive. I love this. We also got this plant. Again, just a lot of greenery to go outside. This one might get ruined outside. This might have to stay inside, but my cats will eat it. So we'll see about that one. I just want to be like surrounded by this outside, you know? We just wanted to get a lot of different leaves, a lot of different textures, and like just fill it in out there to make it very like cozy tropical comfy what am i even saying at this point <laughs> this was another steal this was 16.99 look how pretty this basket is i feel like this is something you would find at like anthropology or like urban outfitters and it would be like 60 dollars literally i just said it and i don't remember it 16.99 this is such a cute basket this is gonna just be like a little decor piece for outside on the deck i'm telling you this backyard is gonna get a transformation i'm so excited this is another thing that i don't know if i'm gonna have use for possibly on the coffee table it might look cute layered with this on the coffee table but we shall see because i don't even have a coffee table yet i have to order one this was 14.99 just a super cute like washed out wood tray this is also great for like barbecues and stuff i don't really have like a nice serving tray so I think this will be useful either way I'll find use for it and the last thing that I got is one of my favorites look how stunning this is Zane loves Buddhas so I kind of got this for him I also think they're just a beautiful symbol of peace so I think this is gonna be this is gonna be this is just gonna be such a beautiful piece to add you know literally peacefulness in the backyard plus you guys this thing is so heavy it rock solid $14.99. This is such a beautiful statue. Oh, I just think it's so nice. I just want to walk outside and just be like, ha, ah, you know? So that is that. I think you guys can kind of see the vibe that we are going for. I am very excited. Obviously, like I said, it's going to be a few more days until we get everything together. But for now, I'm just going to keep it all in the mudroom. At least we have everything. We went before the stores closed down again. Hopefully not, but they might. I also grabbed these garlic chips. They were amazing. And these are so good. These little Italian waffle cookies. Ooh, so delicious. And we haven't had them because I only buy them at Home Goods, Marshalls, or TJ Maxx, and I haven't been. So now we have them again. But now I pay the price I do. I don't know how to forget you. I can't forget you. You're always on my mind. I do the things that I should do. So I can't forget, but you're always on my mind. Okay, we're about to leave for my parents for a barbecue. However, I have a package that says it's from Arizona. I'm guessing it's a PR package, so why not open it with you guys? I have no idea what this is. Welcome to Santa Fe. Welcome to Santa Fe. What is this? It's like kind of heavy. Okay. It is sparkling water. Oh shit. Oh, this must not be Arizona. This must be like a company by Arizona. Arnold Palmer sparkling water? <laughs> this thing said count me. One in. calorie per can? No way. Get the One calorie? I might fuck around and pop this baddie open right now. Wait, is there something under here? Is that it? it? Baby, hold on. Oh, they're all gonna fall. <laughs> oh no. What's going on here? Okay. Oh my god. Why is it so cool? Wait, there's something under here, babe. Is there a gift? Yeah. Oh, a little beef paddle. Oh, fun. Dope. Paddle ball. There's more. Yo, what? They're fucking up. Tell me this. It's a frisbee. 
There's more. That's pretty good for me. A T-shirt. Oh, it's actually kind of cool. Yeah, that looks like dope. What the hell? That is I'll, dope. I'll take that. <laughs> we can share. We look together. What oh, is this? Oh, that good. <gasps> a beach bag. This is so cool. It feels like Christmas. Wait, this is so unexpected. This is so awesome. Look at how big this bag is for the beach. Yeah, it's awesome. And it's such nice quality. Right, feel the shirt. The shirt's good quality too. Yeah. Oh, cool, okay, so what flavors are the drinks? Pink grapefruit, orange mango, lemon, and raspberry lime. And Arnold Palmer. And Arnold Palmer. Which is my Arnold favorite. Palmer. I'm cracking it open. All right, I'm gonna try the lemon. Sparkling water It's sparkling splash. water though, you don't like sparkling water. I like it mixed in my alcoholic beverages. Just thinks it tastes like a LaCroix to me. It does taste like a LaCroix. It's exactly what it tastes like. Mm. This one's good. Lemon? Dope. Oh, I don't that. think you're gonna like that one. That one's very, like, tea. Oh, I smell it. That one's good. Yeah, this oh. one's better. The lemon's good. Interesting. Nice. That's dope. Well, thank you for all the goodies. I guess Arizona, Santa Fe, maybe they made a new company. You see this that? shirt is so cool, babe. I can I picture you rocking this. Is this your size? Small. Looks like it'll fit. I love when companies send PR packages of their product, but then also put like cool little goodies. It makes it so much more exciting. I am out. Did I just put your... What? Where's the second drink? In the refrigerator. Oh. Like, did I just lay it down in the box? That was so freaking cool. That was fun. That was a highlight of my month. <laughs> All right, we're at my parents now. By the way, this is what I was saying before. I ordered a sale, so basically it's gonna be a mini version of this that my parents have to be like nice and shady above the like stuff that we get. How are we gonna keep it up in the middle? Oh, it's small enough, I guess. That's for my dad to figure out. Look at your wood poles are bending. You know that? That's what she said. Thought you'd be gone by tomorrow, but you're still there tomorrow and the next day, the next day. Turn that by into hello. Oh, hello, Bailey. Oh, Bailey. I was like, wait, Bailey's out? No. Hi. Hi, Bella. Hi, Bench. Oh, I know. <laughs> okay, let her out, let her out, let her <laughs> Bailey? Uh, What's happening? She heard us come home. Hi. She's going to get out of that door quick enough. Sugar? Did you have a nice dinner and a nice nap? The purrs. <laughs> By the way, I did update on their Instagram story today. So if you don't follow them, make sure you follow them on Instagram. It's Bella Benji Bailey. But um, if you don't follow up on there, I just wanted to give you guys an update from the last vlog. You guys said it a lot in the comments, which I figured, but they were just nervous from their vet visit and stuff. But they are getting along just as normal now. Bailey is back to normal. She was definitely very, very tired for the first 24 hours. Benji was like a little stressed right after the vet visit, but as you can see, they're back to normal. They've been playing. They've been hanging out just fine. So I'm glad that they're good now. Look at this baby. Hello? Aren't you the cutest? We actually had to leave her alone for like the first like day and a half because she was like in pain. Like if we would try to pick her up, she just like would like yell meow. So we just like left her alone, didn't pick her up, just let her do her thing. She's gonna go steal her food. That's what she's going to. <laughs> she's just trotting away. Bailey. She, oh, she's eating it. Wait, stop her. I can feed her the um. You want the other half of your food? Yeah. She's coming. <laughs> Her little trot is the best thing. I found them a new toy. We do not have to buy you guys toys at all. We should put like little holes in it. They would love it. Yeah. We could DIY it. it yeah. Put some holes in it, paint it. <laughs> they would love it. But I feel like at that point, they're not gonna like it anymore. They right. They, like the raw box. Yeah, they like the novelty of just a box. Yeah, exactly. It looks like a black hole. Oh, there she goes. <laughs> She was behind Benji, so it looks like she just came out of darkness. You guys are gonna love this. Oh! What was that? The blade just snapped off. The hell? Who in the hell put the muffins in the freezer? Do you just constantly say TikTok things all day like I do? Look at that, the freaking blade. This blade that we have sucks. It came in like a kit we got, I think. Yeah. Kitties, what I did for you. 
you're gonna love this. I cut a little hole in it, but I'm leaving it so that it's not big enough. Like, I did it on accident. I was trying to cut it this big, but now I left it so that she can just like peek her head through. But like, she probably actually could fit through here. I'm not gonna lie. All right, you guys, how you like your toy now? Watch, now they don't touch it at all. That would be so funny. Bailey! <gasps> Where's Ben, is he in there too? He's by his food. Oh my God, isn't she so cute? I know. I love she the trots. way she trots around. Bailey! <gasps> Benj, come here! They're both still interested, it looks like. They're both coming. Look on this side. You can see through it now. Oh, now I can see you guys. Hi! <laughs> Benji! <laughs> you still like it? Baby, yeah, look. Look, you gotta come look at this. <laughs> this is hilarious. Yeah. <laughs> What's up, Ben? Do you like your box? <laughs> That's so cute. Oh my god, that's adorable. How do we make this box look cute? Cover it in fabric, and boom, they have a toy. Should mommy DIY it? A DIY cat toy? I should cut little mini holes on the sides too. That'd be hilarious. Can you fit through there, Bailey? I don't think you can. Can you? <laughs> They're fighting through the hole. <laughs> oh my god, this is the best entertainment in a while. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> he got you when you walked away. <gasps> oh, he just bitch slapped you. He feels so powerful in there. Oh my God, here comes Bella. <laughs> she just stood up. This is the best thing I've ever witnessed. What's going on, Belle? She's like, I don't know, but thank God I'm not part of it. Peace out. <laughs> what? <laughs> Benji, what are you doing? Sorry, I scare you. He's just lazily hanging his paw out. Oh my god, that's hilarious. I could film this forever. Damn it, I missed the good part. Bailey just fit through the hole and went out the other side of it. I got a picture on my phone though. Why oh, she just hiss? I moved the box and she hissed at it. Here he comes. <laughs> you guys are just playing slaps. You're just slapping each other. Oh, whoa. Go get him, Bailey. Look, look, like she tried to go in. <laughs> Get in there. Whoa! <laughs> oh my god! Benji, that is terrifying. That is actually so scary. Oh my god, why is your arm so long? <laughs> oh, this is too good. Wow, it's the little things in life. You guys will be entertained for the next two hours. He's got both paws out the hole now. <laughs> and there goes Belle, just rubbing on things, living the good life. You living the good life? You don't have to deal with them. <laughs> oh, oh, now she's got his tail. Bella literally couldn't be more unbothered. <laughs> <laughs> Bella, are you unbothered? Oh no. <laughs> she said not today. <laughs> she just gives you that look and you know, huh, Bailey? I can't believe she fit. <laughs> that is so scary. Benji, you're terrifying. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> Babe, screw kids. Can we just have 10 cats? <laughs> I'm kidding, you guys. I do actually want children, but cats are pretty fun for now. By the way, if you guys are curious, because I always tell you what I'm wearing anyway, this little half zip is from ThreadUp when I worked with them. Um, I got such cute stuff. So if you guys didn't see that haul, I did like a whole try on haul. I'll leave the video down below, but I got some cute thrift stuff. This is like a little champion. I don't know if you can see the logo. It's black on black, but it's a little champion half zip. So cute to throw on like in the summer nights. Today I just had on like, you guys saw these shorts and like a white top, but now I could just like layer this on top of it. And it's like a really cute, lightweight comfiness. Love it. This is how Bella feels about them playing. They make you give the lip. See how different she looks from different angles. You look so cute up here. But down here you look so angry and scared. I still love you. You're beautiful either way. Sorry. <laughs> Anyways, you guys, I'm exhausted. I look exhausted. And I want to get on the computer and order some stuff. I actually asked you guys on our uh, podcast Facebook group for if you could find that couch that I've been looking for. So I want to browse the internet and I want to get stuff ordered because the rug's going to come in a few days. The sale's going to come in a few days. And I want to have it like all put together soon because we don't, I mean, we have a lot of, nice weather 
left, but I want to make the most of it if I'm going to spend money on it. Like, we should have done this a while ago, but pandemic couldn't really go too much shopping. But point of all that? What was the point of all that? You guys <laughs> sent me a lot of links for that bench that I wanted, so I got to browse, find which one I want, order that, and just I want to get some online shopping done. That way I can get like the decorating and renovation vlog up for you guys soon because I'm patient. I'm sure you guys are patient and want to see the final product. I'm so excited for it. So I'm going to go try and get that done. We're going to go therapy retail online. Re what? <laughs> We're going to go online therapy shopping. Always feeds the soul. Anyways, if you guys are interested, um, I got this idea from one of you guys. Her name is Danica. She wanted to know if... We could start doing, instead of just saying notification shout out, when you say notification shout out, you ask a little question and I can answer a little question so you guys can get to know more about me at the end of the video. So I'll see how you guys like it. If you want to be a part of it, just when you say notification shout out please or whatever you say, let me know that you have my notifications turned on. You can add a little mini question at the end there and I will answer it at the end of my video. So if this catches on and you guys like it, I'll continue to do it. But for today, we're going to do a little test run. So she wants to know, how many kids do you and Zane want? For short answer, I want at least two and we'll probably go max three. I assume we're probably going to end up having three because I just like the number three and I feel like that's a good amount of kids to have. I think after we have our third, we're going to be like, all right, that's enough. Or we could have three and be like, okay, we want six. I don't know. But for now, I think our agreed upon, num upon number would be three. So if anyone else would like a notification shout out, you can comment down below letting me know that you have my notifications turned on. And if you want to ask me a question, you can go ahead and you might be in my next video. I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you all next time. Bye guys. I know how to love you now. No matter what I do, I can't let go I don't know how to forget you I can't forget you, yeah